welcome to Daniel's Prayer Program. The Bible says in Acts 2.41, Those who believe what Peter said were baptized and added to the church that day about 3,000 in all. For our first prayer item, let's pray for more opportunities to open Go groups and new churches in our nation and abroad. And how do we pray? Fervently and with joy. And with joy. Lord God Almighty, we come to you. Lord Jesus, Jesus, you are Pray God for more opportunities. For more Bible studies, go groups, God, over our nation, our city, and every other part of the world. Pray, Father, for your grace upon all of us. To reach out, God, for the lost, God. As we invite God, for God, to hear the gospel, to listen to the teaching sharing all the good news of Jesus. We pray that they would to God the favor of God in inviting people to God to listen, to watch, to be praying. And as they hear the gospel, God, their hearts will be open to be open to God. Faith to be saved will be upon them, Lord God, that they will be to God, delivered and even healed in Jesus. As they hear the good news of Jesus, Christ, the of Jesus Christ, the cross of Jesus, the people's hearts will be open, eyes will be open, Lord, we pray that you'll confirm your word, expense and wonders, God, this will result, God, Bible studies opening, God, in homes, God, in different places, Father, even in offices, God, even among friends, among neighbors, God, even, God, in other parts of the world with our relatives and friends. So we pray those Bible studies will grow. God will grow and give birth to another one. Lord. Ask God that everyone will be evangelistic. We want God for genuine touch, Lord God. The presence of God would also share the gospel, God. Like fire spreading to all the world, spreading to all the neighbors, friends, God, and loved ones. Pray God that the gospel would spread like wildfire indeed. Salvation shall be proclaimed, God. Oh, we thank you, Father. In Jesus' name, many people will be saved and will be brought to go groups, more studies, and eventually they become churches, oh God. Your glory, honor, and praise, God. We thank you, God, today. In the name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen and amen. Amen and amen. Next, let us pray for COVID patients to be strengthened and healed completely. Let us lift our voices to God. Heavenly Father, Lord God, we thank you so much for our great healer, God. Thank you so much that this COVID will be in the nation. Lord, thank you that you are our great healer. Thank you for this COVID person. Lord, that you will heal in their lungs in Jesus' name. Lord, that you will heal in their lungs in Jesus' name. Lord, that you will heal in their lungs in Jesus' name. Lord, God, let your mercy be upon them, God. Lord, we pray that you will be upon them. Restoration to good health be upon them, Lord. 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 Lord, we thank you. You will visit them, Lord God, in their strength. You will thank you, Lord Jesus, for your great sacrifice. Lord, thank you so much that they are alone. You are there, Lord God. Punishment and brothers. Thank you, Lord God. Thank you, Lord God. By your wounds, we have been healed. Thank you so much, Lord. We the one who will heal them as you have promised. We are claiming your promise, Lord God. By your stripes, we have been healed, Lord God. Thank you so much, Lord God. You will bring forth healing in their body. Lord, I pray that you will bring forth healing in their body. Lord, I pray that you will bring forth healing in their body. Lord, I pray that you will bring forth healing in their body. Lord, I pray that you will bring forth healing in their body. Lord, I pray that you will bring forth healing in their body. Lord, I pray that you will bring forth healing in their body. Lord, I pray that you will bring forth healing in their body. Lord, I pray that you will bring forth healing in their body. Lord, I pray that you will bring forth healing in their body. Lord, I pray that you will bring forth healing in their body. Lord, I pray that you will bring forth healing in their body. Lord, I pray that you will bring forth healing in their body. Lord, I pray that you will bring forth healing in their body. Lord, I pray that you will bring forth healing in their body. Lord, I pray that you will bring forth healing in their body. Lord, I pray that you will bring forth healing in their body. Lord, I pray that you will bring forth healing in their body. Lord, I pray that you will bring forth healing in their body. Lord, I pray that you will bring forth healing in their body. Lord, I pray that you will bring forth healing in their body. Lord, I pray that you will bring forth healing in their body. Lord, I pray that you will bring forth healing in their body. Lord, I pray that you will bring forth healing in their body. Lord, I pray that you will bring forth healing in their body. Lord, I pray that you will bring forth healing in their body. Lord, I pray that you will bring forth healing in their body. Lord, I pray that you will bring forth healing in their body. Lord, I pray that you will bring forth healing in their body. Lord, I pray that you will bring forth healing in their body. Lord, I pray that you will bring forth healing in their body. Lord, I pray that you will bring forth healing in their body. Lord, I pray that you will bring forth healing in their body. Lord, I pray that you will bring forth healing in their
Lord let His presence be there, healing them. Now we will be praying for all parents to be filled with hope and wisdom as they teach their children the fear of the Lord. Let us pray. Father God, we pray. Father God, we also be praying Lord. All of the Holy Spirit, they will be strengthened in their innermost being. Don't ever give up. They will continue to be the trust in the name of Jesus. Penetrate in the Word of God. How to grant them the wisdom that they need. How to helping their children, instructing their children, and God, the fear of the Lord, give them the wisdom, give them the ability, God, to relate to them well in a way that the children will understand them and respect them. Father God, touch them, God, with your grace. Touch them with strength and wisdom, Father. Lord, give them the ability to relate well to their children, God. Really, model after them in seeking the Lord, in spending time with them. God, reading the word of God every day, coming to the house of God, and meditating upon the word of the Lord. My father, my children will be able to be a good example to their parents, an example to how their parents live, to their such the parents, to their fathers and mothers, even the solo parents, praying with joy, with the, the same time that there's their children, the understand. Of the parents, children, God, the humility, God, to obey the parents, God, to study hard, Lord God, unity, God, in the family, God, unity of faith, unity of love, Lord God, Lord. unity of love for God. Thank you, God, that every family will be under the love and the power of Jesus Christ. Pray, God, that the spirit, the spirit, God, of love, joy, peace, kindness, God, to control humility. To be all there in the family, God, within the family. We will give wisdom, God, to the parents, wisdom, God, to the children, God, them to know what to do, God, and how to do the assignments, God, and for them. It's got their jobs, God. So they bless them, God, strength, success, and prosperity. Oh, Lord, we thank and honor you for me, Lord, this is possible. We thank you, Lord, God, for your love and grace in the mighty and in the name of Jesus Christ, God, we pray. Amen and amen. 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 And for our fourth prayer item, let's pray for miracle provision and double restoration of the blessing for our people. Let us all pray. Lord, heaven, Lord God, we thank you so much. Thank you, God, for, God. for being our salvation, God, for our restoration, God, of our people, for the blessings of God in our lives. Lord, we thank you, God, for your people, God, for your people, God, for the days of all the world, all the world, for the man of day, God, for the rain down, God, for the people that are in the desert, God, for the water, for the water, for the rocks, God, for the water, for the water, for your people, provide as you said, Lord, in your word, will have provide for the needs of your people, according to your glory and riches in Christ. Father, we Father, we Father, we give you are God in your love. Lord God, we pray for a miracle provision that every family for their 
Now for our prayer item number five, let's pray for unveiled hearts and openness of people as we share the gospel to them. Let's pray fervently. Father God, Lord we God, we thank you, thank you, thank you for your will. All men be safe. The open is the question of the heart and the hindrance is there. Illuminate invitation for and listen hear the gospel that being shared thank you Father if we share the gospel they would listen we invite even the families God we invite people to be people to come and the families would come too and we pray for the Holy Spirit from your word I to the one for healing for uh, miracles, all over. Thank, thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. That the people that we know would pray God for us to be able to hear the gospel. Hear the gospel. Help us to be able to witness to the power of you. And this is what God confirmed for the message of salvation of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, they will be saved. Oh, yes, God, they will be healed, delivered, and transformed. By the power of Jesus Christ, oh Lord, touch them. Oh Lord, give them strength, oh God, and feed them, oh God, deliverance, Father. That in Jesus' name, they will indeed be saved, oh God. Oh yes, God, in Jesus' name. See her on the shad, on the side, on the side. See her on the shad, on the side, on the side. See her on the shad, on the side, on the side. See her on the shad, on the side, on the side. The name of Jesus we pray. Amen. Amen. We would like to thank you for joining us in this time of fervent prayer. Daniel's prayer program airs at 5.45 in the morning, 11.45 near noon time, and at 8.45 in the evening from Mondays to Fridays. This is Pastor Rafi Manalo, and God bless you all.